Adam's family history. This is the family history of Adam. When God created human beings, he made them in God's likeness. He created them male and female. And on that day he blessed them and named them human beings. When Adam was 130 years old, he became the father of another son. He was in the likeness and image of Adam. Adam named him Seth. After Seth was born, Adam lived 800 years. During that time he had other sons and daughters. So Adam lived a total of 930 years. Then he died. When Seth was 105 years old, he had a son named Enosh. After Enosh was born, Seth lived 807 years. During that time he had other sons and daughters. So Seth lived a total of 912 years. Then he died. When Enosh was 90 years old, he had a son named Kenan. After Kenan was born, Enosh lived 815 years. During that time he had other sons and daughters. So Enosh lived a total of 905 years. Then he died. When Kenan was 70 years old, he had a son named Mahalalel. After Mahalalel was born, Kenan lived 840 years. During that time he had other sons and daughters. So Kenan lived a total of 910 years. Then he died. When Mahalalel was 65 years old, he had a son named Jared. After Jared was born, Mahalalel lived 830 years. During that time he had other sons and daughters. So Mahalalel lived a total of 895 years. Then he died. When Jared was 162 years old, he had a son named Enoch. After Enoch was born, Jared lived 800 years. During that time he had other sons and daughters. So Jared lived a total of 962 years. Then he died. When Enoch was 65 years old, he had a son named Methuselah. After Methuselah was born, Enoch walked with God 300 years more. During that time he had other sons and daughters. So Enoch lived a total of 365 years. Enoch walked with God. One day Enoch could not be found because God took him. When Methuselah was 187 years old, he had a son named Lamech. After Lamech was born, Methuselah lived 782 years. During that time he had other sons and daughters. 
so Methuselah lived a total of 969 years. Then he died. When Lamech was 182, he had a son. Lamech named his son Noah. Lamech said, Noah will comfort us from the pain of our work. The pain is because God has cursed the ground. After Noah was born, Lamech lived 595 years. During that time he had other sons and daughters. So Lamech lived a total of 777 years. Then he died. After Noah was 500 years old, he became the father of Shem, Ham, and Japheth.